flipping excited. Get ready to be to go prom dress shopping. I've like waited for this day for so flipping long. I like cannot wait. So I'm already saying like off the bat, I'm not showing you my dress till like prom day. And I don't know if we're gonna find the dress today or like go somewhere else on another day. And like I know what color, I know what style roughly, and like. And I want to make myself look how I would look on prom so I can get the full picture. So that's why I put my hair in rollers. I'm going to do some lashes too. And like, just, you know, look how I would want to look. Because my prom is on the 19th or something like that of June. So it's pretty soon after GCSEs. So, you know. That's what I'm doing for skincare. Um, Let's just do some primer and my normal skincare plus lashes and maybe a little bit of eyeliner. But like eyeliner with eyeshadow, not with black because I just don't look good with them. And like I'm really obsessed with silver jewellery right now. Now like I love, love, love silver jewellery because, I don't know, it just looks pretty. So we're wearing all silver jewellery today. Oh my god, you actually don't know how really excited I am. I'm so excited. Most of my friends have already got on their prom dresses. So like I'm kind of behind, but like I don't really care. Because these things take time. I don't actually know in how long we're leaving. And so like... My mom said we're leaving in like an hour, but like quite some time ago. So then if we're leaving in half an hour and ten minutes and whatever. And it's oh my god, I still need to have time to do my lashes. So we're gonna like pelt it. We're gonna like, you know, hurry hurry up a little. Like we're not gonna rush, we're gonna speed up, okay? We're just gonna not diddle daddle. Also, I literally cannot believe it. We hit 700 k Are you me? literally i cannot express how grateful i am like that is actually insane that is insane i tanned last night but i don't think it did anything because i'm still literally the color of this shirt hello hello what is this acrobatics excuse me what is going genuinely what is going on what is this shadow here i've never had like a shadow there genuinely hello but other than that makeup's looking okay so i'm just gonna just gonna carry on stop do you see that? That is not okay. That is not okay. I thought this was going to be one of those things that just never ends, but clearly it's ending. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. The blush ruined it. The blush bloody ruined it. Okay, we're going to give a... If I can get my words out, that'd be nice. I'm going to quickly spray my face and do highlighter and then I'm going to do my lashes off camera and I'll be right back. Okay, so I've just done my lashes using the Flash Lash lash kit and for like someone who doesn't do lashes that often and like doesn't it doesn't really suit these actually look so good okay now it's time to take out my hair which is literally like my favorite part okay i've just taken my hair out and it's a bit crazy but it looks really good, it looks really good. okay i'm done bye guys hey guys get ready with me plus eden and her little helmet because she can ride a bike now i'm so opening these sweets for her there you go and then Eden wants to watch me do my makeup, so we're going to watch. Anyway, who likes my new shirt? My mum went shopping to the York Designer Outlets and she went in her Alpha Lauren and she saw this and a cute little jumper I'll show you at the end. Uh, and I was like, oh my God, please get that for me. Like, I'll give you the money. Please just get it. And how cute is this shirt? I'm wearing it with these flared jeans and it's honestly one of my favourite items of clothing now. Are you literally going to sit here and watch me? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Look, guys, Eden got me a present. Show everyone the present you got me. She got me a poo P Pez. Um, and it's sparkly, guys. It's sparkly, guys. It's sparkly. It's a sparkly poo. When I came in today, Eden said to me, she was like, Tula, can we go upstairs and make TikToks? Didn't you? Yep. I can. And let me turn my helmet off first. Then you can put it back on. Not too, not too tight. Okay. Okay. But I was like, um, I don't think I'm making any TikToks right now, Eden. And she was like, oh. so now I'm making a get ready with me. And of course, Eden is here. Also, don't I put too much on my nose, so I'm going to have to do that now. Look, I'm spotty. <laughs> but this is contour, Eden. This makes my face look brown. And you want to put makeup on me? Oh, thank you. I won't get it on the white shirt, Mum. Don't worry. But Eden, I can't put it on you because Mum will tell me off. Won't she? What about, what about secrets? But I'll put you a secret. Let it go. Say it again. Tell her again. Play Let It Go. Alexa, play Let It Go. Hello. It's time to see what I can do. Woo! We've got to test the limit. 
the right, no road, no rules for me. I'm free. <laughs> Let it go. I've done all my makeup and I'm literally ready. Eden's got to ride her bike and I'm done. So I love you guys. I'm, I love you guys. I'm showing the outfit quick. My room is such a mess, so ignore that. But I'm wearing this real cute Ralph Lauren little shirt with these flares and bursts going, of course, and belly piercing, which I cannot do my jeans and pull away because I don't want to catch it. So this is what we're dealing with. And I'm going to use this perfume all over. And then, yeah, I'm done. So I love you guys. I'll see you later. Bye. Here's the makeup, by the way. I've been watching very many, very many tutorials since you guys criticised my makeup so much. I've been watching so many tutorials. So fingers crossed it's getting better. Anyway, I love you. So I'll see you later. Bye. Hey guys, get ready with me at my dad's house. I wasn't going to make one of these, as I've explained before. But, but I've changed my mind because I found some time just before I have some sausage sandwiches and I thought I'd make a quick video. I'm actually so here for today's fit. It's just a black jeans I wore yesterday because these are the only ones I brought to my dad's house. And then I brought this really cute top. Oh my God, I've got bronze and drops in my hair. I can't be too loud because my little brother's asleep, but isn't this top so cute? You can kind of see my bra a bit, but oh my God. I'm literally, this, this phone case, right? The sticky one, it's so helpful. I'm literally sticking you to this mirror. Right, but the bed is actually right here, so I'm trying to like squidge it. Anyway, I need to stop waffling. The reason I'm out of breath is because I just ran downstairs to grab my phone. Because I left it downstairs. But I saw a TikTok, right? So last night, me and my dad and my sister watched the Barbie movie. Oh, I've watched it loads of times. But my dad hadn't watched it before and he really wanted to watch it. So we put it on. The only thing with this top is I keep having to pull it up. Also, TikTok, you better, t better not take me down. This is just a top. Stop being dramatic. Anyway, last night me and my dad watched a Barbie movie and I think our phones listened to us because I was just scrolling on my For You page, right? And a video about womanhood and like manhood. I need to be quick because my dad's literally just calling me downstairs right now for dinner, uh, lunch, whatever you want to call it. But I was watching a video about womanhood and manhood and I was saying about how like being a woman is like, it's just the, all the synonyms on Google are just like talking about like, our body and being like curvaceous and like so one of them was thick like thick was one of the synonyms for womanhood whereas for like manly all the synonyms were brave and strong and courageous and it just made me feel like horrible also please ignore my atrocious tan here it's actually so bad also i've left my setting spray upstairs and i can't be asked to go and get it so i'm just gonna use this anyway i don't think i've ever met a man or a boy as they all are in this generation that is actually like brave or strong or courageous like they're all just they're all just boys so whatever man is making up these google definitions actually needs to get a grip because he's probably a boy as well or at least he acts like one right my dad's really calling me now so i have to go but yeah i just wanted to make a quick video about that tiktok that i saw and whilst i get ready but my little sister's calling me Right, I really need to be quick because my sister's calling me, but... <laughs> right, my dad is going to get annoyed at me, but yeah, I just wanted to say that, like, the Barbie movie is, like, so empowering. Like, women are so amazing. Like, I just... They're so amazing. And I feel like people are going to make fun of me for saying this, but I don't even care because... I feel like it needs to be spoken about more. I miss, I see so many men hating on the Barbie movie. It's like the whole point of the movie is, is that men hate on women. So yeah, I just hate seeing men hate on the film. But yeah, I actually really do need to go now. I'm going to put some powder on off camera and go downstairs. But yeah, I love you guys so much. Mwah, and I'll see you later. Get ready. <laughs> Get ready with us to go shopping. Okay, I wasn't joking when I say my drug elephant moisturizers are literally empty. Wait, it is, it, guys. Mine is, it came mine out. Mine is empty, actually empty, and it really needs to get a new one. But anyway, we're getting ready to go shopping, and Scarlett's in the middle of curling my hair, but she doesn't need some moisturizer her face. I'm just gonna use, oh, see my hair. There's nothing left. I'm We. <laughs> okay, Scarlett's curling my hair for me. I'm gonna use this Biome moisturizer. Anita has it, and she said she really likes it. Is that too much? No. Ew, it's got that little hard bit. Anyway, this guy's gonna make up because we was meant to actually leave um, half an hour ago. 
But okay, they're a bit this loud. Is this is not like Scarlet. Scarlet is always so punctual. And early. It's not even punctual, you're just extra early. Like, our school starts at 8.30 and Scarlet gets there at 8am. It's not my choice. It's not my choice. <laughs> it's not my choice. But anyway, we're getting ready to go shopping. Where we go shopping is about half an hour away. So we need to leave in two minutes. All my hair's going in half, well, it's going like a little bit, but it's going in half of our time. I'm using this elf primer because it's fun. I used all my makeup yesterday and my makeup. Ha- and uh, this doesn't sound like scissor, but my Skip. makeup. Yeah, it doesn't sound like scissor, I don't know why. But I used this um, primer yesterday on my makeup, and my makeup has never looked so good in my life. <laughs> okay, we're finally here together. My face is really sticky and it feels really gross on the face. But then, and when you put your makeup on, it feels good. Let's start off with my flawless filter. I literally did not do any skincare. I just shoved the minimal moisturiser I have. Ooh, there's hair on my face. Why, is that, why have I always got hair everywhere? It's so disgusting. Also, I'm really scared my flawless filter right is going to come off. Because everyone says that theirs is always coming off. And I don't want mine to come off because it's just like a bougie. Wait, I have to do this. Ew, I've got Wait, where is it? Why have I got hair everywhere? The hair glitch has more in it. But everyone's Why are they looking the same colour? Why are they looking the same colour? BFFR. Scarlett's got lie. She's, Scarlett's got a teeny weeny bit of a tanner because she just got back from her little Europe. But room. this phone, this phone does not make you look like that. So. No, my phone always makes me look so pale. But she's this is my first time seeing her. Look. Like, ugh, stop being a hater. But anyway, um, Oh wait, how long have I not seen you for? She's been away three, for four. Yeah, she's been away for two weeks, but I haven't seen her in like three. So this is our first time seeing each other in what feels like forever. Clean! I know, I washed all my brushes. Are you proud of me? This is literally the first time in my life I've ever washed my own brushes. My mum always washes them for me. I'm at my jeans. Mix him! <laughs> I've got a hot... <gasps> Did you get concealer on your top? No. <laughs> this smells really bad. I know. It smells really perfumated. It's not bad. I think you should Play buy them. it. I literally convinced Yanni to buy it. I know, but it's worth it. No, I think it's we need to be done by like 30. No. Oh, I thought you were talking about them. We need Girls. to be done by like 35. Okay, hey, we've got four manitos. Ooh, makeup is looking a snitch. Okay, hey, now I'm going to go in with... Why am I actually looking so bad? And you're, oh, and on your phone. Real, that's a sh- that's a shocker. Why am I looking so short? I'm looking really short. I don't like looking short. Shoot. But don't hate on me. Anyway, so um, what was it? When was it? This morning I woke up with a fat pimple. It wasn't even a pimple. It was like an underskin spot on my forehead, and I popped it, and then it started bleeding, and now it really really hurts, and I've got a bright red mark on my forehead. Oh, your Charlotte Tilbury brown blush. Okay, I've got this too, but mine is like a ready Can shade. I just say? Huh? Look, it's my shade. I don't know how to open this. Okay. But I'm using my save brush, it's easier to open. It's my shit. What? Oops. <laughs> we're gonna watch a movie today. We was gonna go and watch a back to black, but then they only have it either for oh that's really really pigmented. Oops. And anyway, they only have it for either one o'clock or four o'clock. If we watch it at four, we end at six. If we watch it at one, it ends at like three. And the no, shot one hour before the thing. Yeah, three. Exactly. So there's just no no point in going on a Sunday. So we're gonna go a different day and be we smarter. Should go after school. Yeah, we're gonna. My mom said that we're gonna go after school one day. Do you wanna come around my one day after school? Yes. <laughs> yeah. I've suffered in school without Scarlet for a few days. Like we have no lessons together, but it doesn't matter. Like, but like, I need to see each other. Like, exactly. literally at the end of every lesson. At the end of every lesson, she's waiting for me, or I'm waiting for her. But I suffer without having Scarlet. Like, who am I? Like, I've got friends. Don't get me wrong. I have friends. I'm not like friendless. Like, Scarlet isn't my only friend. But it's like she's. Only but friend. we basically are. We basically are each other's only friends. So I need her, and I haven't had her, and I don't like, know why I met we her. We have one. friends, but we act like we basically don't have. Talk about this, we're cutting this all out. No, I'm keeping this all in. Oh, I thought this was an eyebrow gel. Where's your eyebrow gel? Okay, I'm gonna be the See, look, we get really, really far. Exactly. Where where is this thing? Guys, look, I got Where's your eyebrow gel, Scarlett? I know she. Oh, I want that. Scarlett, you're kicking me off the chair. Look at me. (laughs) Where where is your eyebrow gel? I don't even know why I cleaned up last night. <laughs> well, like. Why would you clean up if I was coming round? Eyebrows have never looked so bad in my life. Guys, they're so cute. They're actually giving your like I'm really cute. They just people. reminded of me and you, like basically. The bracelets just look like me. This is all. <laughs> oh, my curls are disgusting, Scarlett. What have you done to me? <laughs> you look amazing. <laughs> okay, wait. My eyebrows look really bad. Mummy, baby. Okay, bye guys. Hang on, we'll be back. We'll be back. Okay, I'm using Scarlett's Hill 
perfume. I didn't even do my wrist. Come on. Okay, guys, well, this is our little outfit for the day. So I topped up from White Fox. My jeans are from White Fox. Where's your jeans from? Zara. Shoes are Adidas Sambas. <laughs> my bag is White Fox. Louis Vuitton. Boom. Bye. Hey, guys, get ready with me for the day. My flicks have low key been quite good recently. Um, So today. It's Sunday, I'm not doing much. It's just a bit of a Sunday reset, clean and all that. Oh my god, also the other day, um, after school, I went to Zara and I got a black version of this top, like the frilled sleeves one. And it's actually so cute. because so I've already got white, orange and pink. But I think they've discontinued the colours that I have because the pink I have, there's a baby pink now, but mine's like hot pink. And there's orange, orangey yellow. But I can never see those in the shops anymore, so yeah. Um, I don't know whether I'm going to do makeup or not today, but I'm going to use my Glorious Peaky Hue Drops. So I've got this big spot on my forehead and it really hurts. And I've got so many spots on my forehead, you just can't see them on camera, but it's so annoying. Oh my gosh, and my vlog of when I went shopping with Layla is coming out today um, at 5pm. So guys, subscribe to my YouTube and stay tuned for them because I honestly love that vlog. And it was the first vlog that I made like in public with my new camera. So you guys can see how good the quality is and everything. Right, I'm just gonna use this Nivea Soft Cream. I don't know why the weekends go so fast. How have I already got school tomorrow? I don't know what they've put in this cream all of a sudden, but it is like so good. This is the most hydrating cream ever. It's never usually like that. Might just have to start using this more often. Right, I'm gonna use my e.l.f. Power Grip Primer. I love the feeling of wearing a new top and jewellery, like, it's just such, like, a fresh feeling. And my hair is freshly washed as well. I've done, like, my whole Sunday night routine in the morning just because I wanted to feel fresh. Um, so, yeah. Guys, comment down below YouTube video ideas that you want me to do. I might put a poll up on my Instagram story as well because, like, now I'm not in half term anymore. I'm not going to do much vlogs unless, like, I go places in the weekend. So yeah, I know I have got a school morning routine that I filmed. So if I like how it's edited and if the video is long enough, because if it's like two minutes long, don't know where I'm going to post it. But yeah, I've got that. Um, I've just dropped this. Anyways, I'm now going to use my Charlotte Tilbury Flores filter. But yeah, just comment down below video ideas that you want. But I can't wait till the summer. Like the summer vlogs are going to be so fun. But yeah, I'm just going to use some of this. I'm actually going to use a beauty blender to blend it out. I usually use a um, makeup brush, but yeah, I just think I'm going to try it out with this. Right, I finished blending it out, and now I'm going to use my Kosis concealer. I'm just going to use some under my eyes and on my chin. Um, it's okay right here. Okay, right, now I'm going to use my Rare Beauty bronzer. Where's my bronzer brush? They were practice. I literally love this. I've been using it for so long and I've still got like, I don't want to twist it all away in case it falls off, but I've still got a lot left. So I definitely recommend this bronzer. Um, do you know what I've just realised? I don't know if it's just me, but I feel like I've never actually had any makeup run out. Like skincare I have. Like actual makeup. Honestly, makeup lasts so long for me. I'm just trying to think like, I don't think I've ever had a makeup product run out. I definitely over bronze, but it's okay. I'm definitely an over bronze, over over blush person. Like over blushing does not suit me at all. I just look really weird and red. But bronze looks fine. Um. Anyway, speaking of blush, I'm gonna use my Rare Beauty one, and this is in the shade Happy. That you've been with, I'm gonna trust you. I'm gonna give you. Okay, I'm gonna blend this out with this brush. Oh no, I forgot that it's pigmented very much. I'm finna look like over blushed in a minute. I switched to Beauty Blender, but I low-key just feel like blush kind of ruined it. It's okay, it's okay. In like 15 minutes, the blush would have worn down and Alexa, turn down one. It won't be noticeable anyway. Um, I've got way too many brushes. I don't even use half of these, but I cannot fit anything in. Okay, I'm gonna use my sh Ow. Charlotte Tilbury setting spray. I'm gonna do my lashes, then I'll be I'll be. Right, I'm back. Lashes are done. Um, I'm gonna use my Romeo London lip liner. You're right here. 
Right, I'm going to use my shiny lip gloss. Haven't used this in a while. This is very iconic. But I'm bringing it back for today's video. Okay, this is the makeup. Loki starting to think blush ruins my makeup and I might stop using it or just use less. But anyways, bye guys. Hey y'all, get ready with me for two birthday parties. I feel like this happens so often where like I don't go to any birthday parties or like none of my friends have their birthdays. And then it's like all of them are in like a matter of a weekend. Like it's crazy that like all of the events all happen on one day. It's kind of annoying though. I still need to put together their gifts. So let me know if you guys want to see it. You guys always love those videos. I'm so tired. I've been getting home like so late these last couple days just because I've had so many things. Let's go through it. Starting on Wednesday, Bella came over and we celebrated her 22nd birthday. My mom made dinner and we had key lime pie and it was so much fun. We just like hung out and of course she went through my PR drawer. Anytime my friends or family come over, they always go through my PR drawers, which is basically just like any PR that like I haven't used yet or don't want. I always give them like a cutesy little shopping bag and they just like go through it. It's so cute. Thursday night, I went to see Elizabeth and Lucy in the play Footloose that my school was putting on. I can confidently say that that is the best production that my school has ever put on. Like it was incredible. Like legit every single person did like actually incredible. Like my jaw was on the floor. If you guys didn't know, Lucy is a senior and she gave her senior speech at the end of it. And I was, I was, I was done for. I was crying the whole time. It was so And then last night I went to another musical. I went and saw Beetlejuice at our local theater. It's called Seegerstrom. And we legit got home at like 11.30 at night because it went so late. But honestly, so worth it. I like how even though I put on foundation, you can like still see my freckles peek through. I knew like every single song from Beetlejuice, but I've actually never actually like watched it or known like the story behind it. So I thought that was really cool. I just said actually like 50 times in like 20 seconds. And before that musical, I had my last track meet of the season. I ran the 800 and I was so, so proud of myself by the end of it. That was my PR and I just... I was so happy. Since I'm trying to go a little bit fancier, I'm gonna use this little palette. You guys know I just go like that and then go like that. Anyway, I'm kind of sad that track season's over, but you know, like practice is still going on, so I'm still gonna see everyone and you know, yay. Okay, I never really do like lip liner or lip combo, but I kind of wanna use my Charlotte Tilbury one today. That looks so good. It's the lip liner in the shade Iconic Nude, and then I love using the Charlotte Tilbury lip gloss over top. That's so cute. It's a little bit darker than usual, so after this like dries a little bit, I'm gonna put on this one. Anyway, final step, my setting spray. I opened my eye and that went straight in my eye. Okay, bye guys. Thanks for getting ready with me. Get ready with me using only green makeup. If you're new here, rule is you can only use products that have green somewhere in the packaging. Starting off with this Glow Recipe Avocado Serum. For primer, we have this Wet n Wild Glass Corrector Base. First time using this. This is a skin corrector and a glass skin primer. I'm nervous. This is very green and it feels very thick. Oh wait, it's actually blending out very nicely. Definitely giving me that glass skin. Look at that. Foundation, I have this It Cosmetics CC Cream and my Green Beauty Blender. I don't think It Cosmetics is capable of making a bad product. For concealer, the only one I I had was this one from Physicians Formula. I'm gonna go in on the concealer and kind of use it as a lighter shade to brighten up my face. It's actually my second time doing an all green makeup look. If you guys scroll down on my page, I have a whole playlist for my color series. But it's been a while and I made sure to try and choose new products this time. For bronzer, we have this pixie stick. I've been wanting to try this for so long. Look at that. It looks so good. I'm so excited. I'm gonna use this for some contour. I think the shape of this is just so fun. No. Ooh, I like this pixie stick looks so pretty and radiant i had no cream blush but i do have this physician's formula lip tint i don't think this is meant to go on your cheeks but i'm gonna put just like a little bit it does not feel like it's meant to be a blush but we're gonna blend it out with our fingers just for like a little bit of color it just feels like there's lip gloss on my cheeks you know what i mean put some on my lips because they feel so dry right now for powders all i have is this physician's formula bronzer highlight and blush all in one take my brush and go right in just this light shade try and use this to set my under eyes i believe this isn't a mistake because it is a highlighter but did that even do anything do it on the other side i'm gonna take the little blush side dust this on my cheeks oh my god my brush is like sticking to my face because of the lip gloss oh my god the bigger fluffy brush and just kind of swirl it all together bronze up my face and set the same contour physician's formula really came through for this video we're looking very bronzy very dewy 
For eyeliner, I had this green felt tip eyeliner pen. I thought it'd be fun for us to try to do a green wing. I haven't done a felt tip liner in so long. That is green though. These are so fun. Should I try to do the thing where I like connect it into my crease? I don't know. That's kind of crazy. <gasps> oh gosh. Okay, it's not terrible. It's a little scary when I close my eye. I don't know why I keep adding more because I just keep making it worse. I just have to do it on the other side. Good enough. For mascara, we have this Physician's Formula one. Ooh, I think this is a brown mascara. This is a very natural looking mascara. Like for lips, I didn't think I was gonna have any lipstick until I remembered the inside of this Prada lipstick is mint green. Thought I needed to take this opportunity because I love these lipsticks so much. I don't have any lip liner, but cute. Gloss, I have this Milk Makeup Lip Oil and also the Summer Fridays Mint Lip Balm. Last but not least, we have the new e.l.f. Power Grip Dewy Setting Spray. There you go. That is my all green makeup look. Here's a little up close. Let me know what you guys think and let me know which color I should do next. Get ready with me while I tell you makeup trends that I hate. These are mostly makeup trends that I hate on myself, but like, I mean, I guess like some other people could not be rocking it. Please don't get offended by this because like I have seen so many people look good with it. First is strong highlighter in your inner corners. I feel like that trend's kind of starting to die down because I remember maybe like one or two years ago, people used to do it a lot more. But like, I'm not talking about just like some highlighter in your inner corners. Like I'm talking like specifically white extreme like highlighter. Pretend this is the NYX like white highlighter stick or whatever. Like I'm talking about the people who like get the highlighter and they like shove it and they like crust it all up in their inner corners speaking of highlighter i also hate when people don't blend out their highlighter like girl we can see it the next one is how literally everything has to have a name in like the makeup world like strawberry makeup latte makeup um like what girl no you're not doing strawberry makeup you're doing like a blushy look okay this one's probably really controversial so it's basically just for me i'm sure like it's fine for other people but in my opinion i don't like just not wearing any powder like, i feel like it depends on your skin type because like some people have oily skin some people have dry skin but for me like i get so oily and like greasy without powder and i have seen people just like go out with no powder and they look like a full-on grease ball but i mean if you're going for that greasy um it's got cooked baked and glazed look then sure I took off the beauty filter. My makeup looks kind of the same. I'm kind of eating. The next one is like soap brows or just like brows that are like laminated like to the skin. That one is definitely like just on me. Like my brows like can't just like stay still. They have to move somehow. Um, but I feel like if I did do laminated brows, I would look so stupid. Not me saying this as I'm using like a brow wax and like trying to get them to stay. Next one is like big, huge eyelashes. Not like just normal lashes. I'm talking about like the big, fat, like chunky ones, like the huge ones. Like I've never seen actually anyone get them, but I've seen people get them on TikTok and they're weird. That's it. I honestly can't think of any more. Oh, I have another one. Okay, like spider lashes, like ones that like have like, like literal, like they look like spiders and they're chunky and gross. So. Okay, so here's my final makeup look. This is strawberry cooler ultra ice with cookie butter cream and cold foam on top. Also, I just slept in this outfit. This is not what I'm wearing. Guys, peace out. Let's do a makeup tutorial that absolutely no one asked for, but I just feel like doing one. So I've just done my skincare. Usually when I'm putting makeup on, I use my Glow Recipe Serum and then this Laura Posay Moisturizer. I find that this one sits better under makeup than the Glow Recipe one. Starting with primer, this is the only one I've ever used. It's the e.l.f. Power Grip Primer. Usually in Australia, I don't wear makeup unless I'm going out like somewhere fancy. But for some reason in the UK, I've been wearing it more and I kind of like it. I don't usually do brows first, but they're looking a bit weird right now. So recently, I've been using the Lash Therapy Australia Eyebrow Gel. I used to use the e.l.f. Brow Lift before, but I've magically lost that somehow so but honestly i'm not mad about it because i have a brow lamination at the moment and it's the perfect product to like slick it back in like a lamination moving on for concealer i use the hourglass concealer i love this stuff so much it's definitely my new favorite concealer i switched from the elf camo concealer to that one and i love that then i get a wet beauty blender and i blend that out so I'm no makeup artist, I actually know absolutely nothing about makeup, this is just what I do. One tip I do know is that you should use a setting spray in between each step. So this is the Charlotte Tilbury 
setting spray. Guys, I have this like little ring light on my camera right because this lighting is shocking, but it's slowly dying, so the lighting is changing, and I'm sorry for that. Next, for contour, I use the MKB Instant Contour, I think it's called. Yeah. This exploded all over my suitcase, so it's quite empty. But I basically just put it in those spots and then blend it out with a brush. I don't really think this does anything, but I like to think it does. This is completely going flat, so I've just resorted to the front flash on TikTok, and hopefully that this is good. When that is all blended out, setting spray again. Okay, for powder, whatever it is, I use Huda Beauty Easy Bake and Snatch. And then I just pat it under my eyes, like that. Next, for blush, I use this Too Faced blush. I'll put the shade on the screen because I'm not actually too sure which one I have, but it is so pretty. If I'm being honest, I am really excited to go back to Australia and like not wear so much makeup. I don't know what it is about Australia, but I think because the sun's on you all the time, my freckles come out and I don't really wear makeup. Personally, I prefer like the summer natural look on me, but for some reason over here, makeup's been my best friend. But it's always fun to wear some makeup here and there, so I'm not complaining. Do a really quick makeup routine because I've just done this in 15 minutes. I still have mascara to do but that doesn't take long. Usually I get my brows done so that I'm more full but I haven't had them done in a while so while they're not done I use this MCO Beauty Magic Brow in Medium Brown. I find that this is the perfect product for filling in all those little gaps of your brows. Okay lastly for my lashes I use Telescopic Mascara but this one's run out so I've been using the extra black one. Don't think it's any different. So here's the other one I've been using. It's got the same wand. It's just a bit darker, I think. I'm being honest, I have not been happy with my lashes over here at all because I got a lash lift like two months ago and they've now dropped. But my I have like long lashes, right? But when I put mascara on, it makes them look... I don't know. They just haven't looked good because I can't curl them. I forgot a lash curler. But I'll be back once these are done. I literally just coat my lashes with mascara. Like, they're just not as good as what they usually are back at home. I don't know why. It's done, I grab a q-tip and clean the excess mascara off. Okay, makeup is all done, so I hope you guys all have an amazing day.